I feel good. If I could cry, it's all good. let that come back to a boil again okay now that that's come to a boil we're going to add some shiitake mushrooms I actually purchased a um, package of dried shiitake mushrooms and it happens to be um, one ounce dried but it comes to a half pound fresh so that would be eight ounces of fresh um, shiitake mushrooms okay um, I cut them in half or just cut them to more bite-sized pieces I'm going to throw those in. Next, I was cutting off a little bit of the stem of the broccoli because so we're going to add the stem now. Um, yeah, okay. So I cut the end already and then I just cut down thinly to um, uh, save a lot of the broccoli stem because that's a edible and a healthy part too. So we're going to add that in. Let me cut some of those a little bit. That's about okay. Let that cook a little bit before you put the broccoli florets in. So while we have the um, the broccoli stems in, I'm going to add some kale stems as well. Oops. Uh, because it takes them a little longer to cook. That's why I add them early. And that's just one pack of kale. As I always say, um, <clears throat> most things are organic. The kale is organic as well. Uh, I'm just gonna pair this to go. So you'll let those stems cook in there for about two minutes before adding the broccoli florets. And then you'll probably let that cook for about another minute before adding the kale. Actually, I almost forgot my green beans. I, uh, <laughs> those will need to go in with the stems. So I um, purchased this package of, um, they actually are French green beans. And so the whole package was um, a pound. So I put in half the package. So that's going in now. So now <laughs> we'll wait about a minute. So we'll put that broccoli in. That was actually a head of broccoli. <laughs> it's a lot of vegetables, right? <laughs> you notice I keep turning the fire up and down, up and down, up to bring it to boil more quickly, but down to just simmer a little bit. And it's when it's boiling far too strongly. I'm gonna start cutting up onion because uh, it's going to go in. We're approaching the finish line, people. Woohoo! Okay. So that's a medium onion, yellow onion. Okay. I'm going to try to separate these ribbons. You want to cut it as thinly as you possibly can. Just gonna move these out the way for a sec. Sweet red bell pepper, and try to cut that as thinly as you can as well. Generally, half a bell pepper is sufficient. I had a little bell pepper left over from yesterday, so I was trying to use it. But I like a half a bell pepper is generally sufficient for this dish. That 
sufficient. Throw the kale in. <laughs> and push that down in there as best we can. You see the pot is really full. <laughs> We're gonna actually fold it in a bit. Let some of the root vegetables come to the top. Switch places. So the kale made it in there. Yay, okay. Now we're gonna put these peppers, red and green bell peppers inside, as well as the onion, the yellow onion. We just tucked it down there a little bit. We're just gonna put, I chopped up some parsley already. So some fresh parsley chopped up. Uh, hmm, a good bunch, like a whole bunch in your hand. Chop it up, stems and all. Of course, rinse it first. <laughs> Fold in a little bit. Now you have a full pot a vegetable curry, Penang vegetable curry. That's done. It's come back to a boil now, so all we're gonna do is put a lid on it, turn it off, and let it sit for about five minutes. Let's see the finished product. Okay, great. Give it a good stir so that you can bring some of the root vegetables to the top, and you are good. I like to serve it over jasmine rice or basmati rice. That's actually what I made today. Perfect. Okay, now that it's all done, let's see what we got. Mm, let me see. Ooh, let me see. Mmm. Mmm. So that's good. Granted, I know I've made it before, but I made it many times over the years, truth be told. But this right here tastes so authentic. Oh my God, I'm sure it's the galango and the lime leaves. You know, you don't, there's just not enough of that in most of the, the Thai curry paste that you find on the market, especially the mass produced ones. But get the one that I told you to get. Mm. That is so good. That is so good. People are always taking home bowls of this, okay? Mm. Mm. I need a piece of broccoli. Mm. Oh, it's so good. I could cry, it's so good. Mm. See you next time. Bye. I'm gonna enjoy my meal. <laughs>